This is biochar and it has to be one of the most unusual products you can apply to your lawn today. Now I say that because this has been in use for thousands of years, but in terms of lawn care, it's a fairly new product. And in this video, I'm gonna cover what it does, why you should consider using it, and help you decide if it might be the right product for you. First, what exactly is biochar and is it just charcoal? Well, it is similar, but biochar is created by burning something else. It's usually a type of organic matter, but they do it at a very high temperature and they restrict the amount of oxygen in the fire. And what they're left with is a very unique substance that has some pretty amazing properties for your soil and ultimately your lawn. But how does it actually do it? And is biochar a type of fertilizer or a supplement? Well, it's not any of that. And in fact, by itself, biochar can't really do much until you put it into your soil. Biochar is kind of like a bank account for your soil. And just like when you first opened that bank account, you didn't have any money in it. And that's exactly how biochar starts out. In fact, it's gonna absorb things like fertilizer, chemicals, and even nutrients. And that might not sound very good, but it's actually amazing for your soil. Because when you fertilize your lawn, even water it, your lawn can't possibly use all of what you're putting down, and much of it gets washed away and wasted. Well, that's what will get absorbed into the biochar. And that's when biochar becomes that bank account for your soil and ultimately your lawn. But biochar does a lot more than just holding on to things. Those little holes that make up its structure are a perfect area for microbes to grow in your lawn. Now, it might sound kind of gross, but it's in fact really good for the overall health of your turf. And that's why biochar is so unique because it can actually create a better soil structure so that you have those things in your soil when your lawn needs them. The other unusual thing about biochar is it's been used for generations. Here's some photos of soil in the Amazon, and you can see the soil on the left was treated with biochar. It's a lot darker and richer looking compared to the normal soil on the right. And no one quite understands how these ancient people knew that biochar was so effective, but there's clear evidence that they used it to grow their crops to get greater yields. So how can we use biochar at home to make our lawns look better? Well, the good news is in the past few years, there are a number of companies producing quality biochar that you can apply yourself. But some people even make their own biochar at home. Now that might sound kind of fun, but it's not just like burning some materials. You have to do it under control conditions and limit the amount of oxygen if you want to create that true biochar. So for most people like me, I'm gonna just buy a store-bought product that can do the job for me. Now the one I'm using here is made by the Andersons, and I like this particular one because it dissolves really easily in the soil. In fact, you can see these cups here where I put just a tiny amount of the product, and when I add just a small amount of water, it completely dissolves. That means this biochar is gonna go into the soil much quicker than a lot of other products that are out there. And the other good news is biochar is a natural product. You don't have to worry about any type of hazardous chemicals and it's nothing like a pesticide. And applying this one couldn't be much easier. You just open up the bag, pour it into your spreader, and you're gonna adjust the settings on your spreader according to the bag, and then you're basically just gonna spread it around your lawn. And you don't have to water it in, you can just wait for it to rain, but if you wanna water it in, that's fine too. And it's a really good value because it's a permanent application, meaning that once you apply it to your lawn, it becomes part of the soil. This isn't the kind of product you have to apply every year forever. You do wanna build up a certain amount on the soil, and it is helpful to put it down for a few years. And I won't ever recommend a product that I haven't tried myself. And the parts of the video where I'm putting it down were actually recorded last year. I wanted to see if it had any impact on my spring green up this season. And right now it's still mid-May and I'm happy to report that my lawn is definitely greened up sooner and overall looks really good. Now is it because of the biochar? I can't tell you that for sure, but it's definitely different than I've experienced in other past years. And one other point about biochar, there is another kind that you can buy. You can buy a pre-charged biochar that they call inoculated, where it contains things already in the biochar that your lawn can benefit from. Now that might sound really good, but it's not as widely available. And my concern is that some of those nutrients might not naturally occur in my own lawn. So I kind of like the idea of putting a biochar down that kind of becomes one with the soil in my area. If you want to read more about the amazing benefits of biochar, I've linked a couple of scientific papers in the description, and I hope this video was helpful, got you to learn a little bit more about biochar, and help you decide if it might be something you want to consider for your own lawn. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up, and subscribe to my channel if you're not already for more videos coming up.